Hello, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Eva and I am a millennial who is obsessed with makeup. Today we have a video going over my top picks for the Ulta Spring Haul Sale. Now this sale ends on April 20th, so I will be sure to get this up before the 20th hits and it hasn't been getting a lot of buzz at all. I think because it fell during the Sephora sale, but some of these deals are incredible and most of the items I'm going to be talking about are 30 to 50% off. I think the sale is amazing. There are a lot of really great newer items that are on deal as well. Um, I also will link up above. I did an Ulta like fall haul recommendations video six months ago when they had a similar sale in the fall. So I'll have that linked because many if not all the items that I spoke about in that video are also on sale during this one as well. Um, before we get into it, would love if you are not already to subscribe to my channel and then follow me on Instagram. I will have everything linked up above for Instagram. Um, it does really help me out over on YouTube if you follow me on Instagram. And I also share other content that doesn't make it over to YouTube. Let's get started. Um, the way this is going to go is I'm going to go by category. There are so many amazing products during the sale. I like really had to narrow it down. I narrowed it down to I think like 37 products. I don't have all the items in front of me either because I used them up or because I didn't have time to grab them. I woke up at 5 30 to try to quickly squeeze this video in before I head in to work. So sorry that there won't be a lot of product demonstrations during this video but I really wanted to make sure I could get something out before the sale ends. And as always, everything that I am speaking about will be linked down below. And if you shop those links, it does help support my channel. So we are gonna start with non-makeup items because I don't have too many. The first item I wanna touch on are the Touchland Gentle Mists. So I just picked up another one of these during the Sephora sale. These are 20% off. These are overpriced hand sanitizers. However, there is something so special, so magical about these hand sanitizers. Let me open this one up. Um, not only do they come in like a really cute little spray compact, but the product itself, it is a sanitizer mist. The scents are so amazing. They have so many different fragrances. I highly recommend checking these out. They will be 20% off, so they are $8 during the sale. They're also like a great, just like little gift. If you need to give, add something to someone's gift, pick one of these up. The next product is a perfume that I am obsessed with. It's actually a body mist, but I would argue that it's more of a perfume because it is so saturated in scent. And it is the Truly Ma Cherry, Ma Cherry, Ma Cherie perfume. I'm definitely butchering it. I picked this up when the blog Musings of a Muse raved about these when these were on sale previously. And this is one of my favorite cherry fragrances I own. I don't own Tom Ford, so I should caveat, this is not comparing to Tom Ford, but it is such a beautiful, fun cherry scent. It is a, it says it's a warm gourmands and black cherry. So it's not sweet cherry at all. It's very much a gourmand cherry and it is labeled as a perfume mist, but I would say it's more of just like a straight up perfume. It's not a body mist. You're gonna get the saturation level of a perfume and these are 25% off. If you see me looking over here, I have like my notes with everything that's on sale and all the prices, so. Next up is Tree Hut. Tree Hut is going to be, I believe, 25% off. I will correct myself on the screen if that is incorrect. And my top Tree Hut recommendation is their shave oil. Their shave oils are so nice. I really, really like them because when you're shaving your legs, I feel like sometimes the foam will just like fly off your legs when you're shaving, but the shave oil really stays on, coats the legs, and they have so many amazing scents and they are always releasing new scents for the summer and spring. So I would recommend checking out that shave oil. Moving into skincare, um, Bioma is one of my favorite affordable skincare brands. I always recommend it to people when they're asking me for drugstore affordable 
skincare. I feel like so many skincare products in the drugstore are no longer affordable. I was at CVS the other day and a lot of the products were like $45 for like Olay, Neutrogena. It's getting out of control, but Bioma has very fair prices. And one of my favorite products from them is their moisturizing rich cream. I'm going to go ahead and just pull up what is it, what it is on sale for. So the moisturizing rich cream is on sale for $11.89, originally $16.99. So it's quite a steal. It is really, really nice. It's a great one for nighttime or if it's the winter or cold wherever you are or you have really dry skin it's great for daytime as well but it's just a really nice fragrance free rich cream and the packaging is really cute as well the next product is one that's new to me but i've fallen in love in just the few days i've been using it i have the box in front of me it is the la roche posay Cica blast balm b5 i've been having really really like extreme dry skin issues and this has really helped with the areas of my face that have been really chapped it also does actually like soak into the skin so you can wear it under makeup i also love of course using like a traditional vaseline but those are much harder to wear under makeup but this just does a nice job of coating the skin in a thin layer and again it wears well under makeup makeup too i actually have it on under my makeup today and this one i believe will be 30 percent off i will have the discounts listed below in the description in parentheses about what percentage off they are but everything i'm talking about is for the most part 30 or 50 percent off Another Bioma product that I don't have in front of me because I used it up is the Bioma Creamy Jelly Cleanser. This is a really nice jelly cleanser. Pretty sure it's fragrance free. If it's not fragrance free, then at the very least it doesn't irritate me at all. I'll put a note on the screen if it is fragrance free. And this is going to be under $15. I believe it's 30% off and I recommend picking that up and pairing it with the Bioma Rich Moisturizing Cream. Another skincare product that I really have fallen in love with this past quarter is the Tony Molly I'm Rice Active Enzyme Exfoliating Cleanser. This is going to be 30% off. This product is really interesting. The way it works is you pour it out and you actually get powder in your hands and then you add how much water you want to decide how much you want to dilute it. So the less water you add, the thicker it's going to be and the more exfoliating it's going to be. The more water you add, it makes it a little less exfoliating. Hopefully that's making sense, but it's a great, great gentle physical exfoliant. I was using chemical exfoliants for the most part and then I was like, you know what, I really want a gentle physical exfoliant as well especially in like the chin area i feel like my makeup doesn't always fully come off even if i'm double cleansing etc and i like to just keep it in the shower it's it's definitely a little messy so i recommend using it when you're in the shower um and it does a great job of gently exfoliating the skin an spf that i love and i misplaced mine last year i should probably just replace it because mine's definitely expired by now but it is the Undefined Beauty R&R Sun Serum. This is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tinted sunscreen. They have two different shades now. It used to be one universal shade, but they do have two shades. And it is on sale for $19.80, originally around the $28 mark. And it is a beautiful, beautiful SPF. I found out about this from Angie Hot and Flashy here on YouTube and it's amazing. It's so good. It's really pigmented as well. And it just goes on the skin truly like a serum. Wonderful tint, no scent, no fragrance, doesn't irritate my skin, has a high SPF level. And it's one I would recommend definitely checking out, especially because the discount is quite significant. The last skincare product I wanted to touch on is the Cetaphil Gentle Skin Cleanser Face Wash for sensitive skin. It's one of the face washes I have been using a lot this winter to help with my dry sensitive skin. I also like using it as a hand wash as well. 
I know that sounds crazy, but someone had recommended that on YouTube and I like doing that in the winter months when my hands are extra, extra dry because any sort of soap that you're gonna be using hand soap wise, it's going to dry out your skin. So I like using it for my face and then also keeping an extra one around to use as my hand soap. Moving into makeup, I have two foundations I wanna talk about. The first one is the About Face, the Performer Skin Focused Foundation. I love this foundation. I will have my review video linked above if you wanna watch an in-depth review. The shade range is fantastic. There are tons of undertones. It's really great coverage, really beautiful on the skin, looks skin-like. I love the packaging, the applicator. I go on and on in the video, but highly recommend checking that one out. It is 30% off and the shade descriptions online are very accurate. I was able to accurately pick up my shade based on the website descriptions. Another foundation that does not get enough love on here, one that I discovered because of Jen Phelps here on YouTube is the Ulta Beauty Collection Complexion Crush Foundation. I mean, if I had more time this week, I could do an entire video about Ulta Collection favorites because Ulta Collection is so underappreciated. There's some real garbage in there, but there are some real, real gems and it's 50% off during the sale this week. Let me grab the foundation. I'm actually wearing it today. So this is the Medium Coverage Complexion Crush Foundation. I am the shade Fair Neutral. I will say the shades are a little confusing. I'm the lightest shade, but I still feel like the shade isn't super light. Like it's it's if you're very, very fair, you're gonna struggle to find a find a shade. Um, but if you are my shade, then fair neutral would be a good pick for you. I also randomly like that it's a squeeze to tube applicator. I feel like that's nice way to apply the foundation. I just like dot it on, use a brush to blend it out and then finish with a beauty blender. But it is a really comfortable medium coverage foundation. I typically only do light coverage because my skin is so dry, but this is one of the rare medium coverage foundations foundations that I find is really comfortable and it's 50% off. So I believe it's around $10. So if you are in the market for a new foundation or honestly are just curious, this one is so good and it is so affordable. Let's talk bronzers. The first bronzer I'm gonna recommend is from Winky Lux. And this is the new Winky Lux Cheeky Rose Liquid Sculpt. I have the shade Amalfi. Um, I picked this up oh, maybe like a month ago and love this and love the blush formula. Something to note is they are sold out online. However, I would do the find and store option on the app to see if it's available at a store near you. And these are going to be 30% off. Another product that I haven't tried yet, but I've heard amazing things about and I have, and so I wanted to flag that they are on sale, are the NYX Butter Bronzers. I placed an order when these first came out um, for my big bronzer video I'm gonna be doing. I went to open one up this morning. All three of the shades I ordered arrived completely shattered, completely shattered. So I actually just reordered them before this video and then I'll return the ones that are broken. But these are going to be buy two, get one free on all NYX. So I would recommend, even though I haven't tried it yet, but I've heard such good things. I would recommend maybe picking up one of these bronzers during the sale along with a couple of the other NYX items that I'm going to be speaking about. I rarely recommend things or talk about things I haven't tried yet, but I've just heard such good things and that's a pretty good deal, so I wanted to flag. The last bronzer I wanna talk about, I consider it more of a bronzer slash blush. I did use it in a previous video. I will have that one linked up above and it is the Physician's Formula butter glow bronzer and blush okay never mind in the title it does specify it's a blush this is newer this launched a couple of months ago and it's a really really beautiful product on me it's more of a blush the way i like to wear this is i like to swirl both the bronzer shade and the blush shade together and wear it as a blush but the pan size is big enough where you can you just dip into the blush portion and then just dip into the bronzer portion, etc. But it's a beautiful shade when you mix it together. And I mean, Physicians Formula Bronzer 
formulas are just so amazing and this one does not miss. Let's talk blush. I have so many blush recommendations, but I did narrow it down. The first one is the About Face Cheek Freak, Freak Blush Bombs. These are 30% off. These are great. These are a nice lightweight balm formula. Um, the way I like to apply these is I still like to apply these with a brush, just dip in, apply directly to the cheeks. They're a really thin formula, very glowy, very dewy. They're really, really unique. I need to do like a deep dive on About Face or do a video kind of going over all of their products that I've tried because they have some really good ones and the blush balm is one I recommend and it is going to be 30% off. The next blush product is from Winky Lux. I cover this in my big um, blush video, recommendations video, and they are the blush version of this that I already talked about. So these are the Cheeky Rose Liquid Blushes. These are 30% off. These are so cool. Again, I'm demoing the bronzer right now, but they have this little like felt tip applicator where you dip in and apply. It allows you to be really precise. They blend like a dream. They last all day. They are sold out online, but as I mentioned, do the like find in store option to see if you're able to pick these up in store because they're great and they're 30% off. Another blush that I picked up, I tried it on in store many times and was always hemming and hawing about it, but then Jen Phelps spoke about these in one of her recent videos and I ordered a bunch of shades during the sale and I'm in love. These are the Florence by Mills Cheeky Pop Blush Sticks. So this is Millie Bobby Brown's brand. And this is the shade My Mimi. I'm actually wearing it today. These are very, very pigmented. And they're more of a, I would say, a satin finish. And they blend really, really easily. Like, I applied a lot of product and I'm... I'm easily able to blend that out with just my finger within seconds. Another cheek and lip product stick that I absolutely love and I maybe need to like restock um, is from Flower Beauty. And these are the Lip and Cheek Gel Crush Stick Balm Thingies. I'll include a photo on the screen, but I absolutely love the purpley shade. I'll put the name of it on the screen. This is such a great quick product to just make you feel more alive in the morning. Like some mornings when I have a work from home day and I've overslept, I'll just like do my skincare and then apply that on my cheeks and lips. And it's a great way to just liven up the face. And these are more of a dewy finish than compared to the Florence by Mills one. So if you want more of a satin to matte finish, get these ones. If you want something that's a little more dewy, a little like juicier on the cheeks, then you will want to pick up the Flower Beauty ones. I am racing through. I have 10 more minutes to get through everything before I need to head to work. Um, the next is from Undone Beauty and this is their Leap Lip Leap Lip to Cheek Cream Palette. Um, I haven't really used these on the lips, but I love these on the cheek, they're a great cream blush formula. They've extended the line quite a bit. So I need to look into like what shades I have versus which ones I don't to see if there are any new ones that I'm intrigued by. But it's a really nice cream blush formula and these are I believe going to be 30% off. The last blush I wanna cover are the Juvia's Place L Blush Liquid Blushes. These are fantastic. They are very, very similar to the Rare Beauty ones. Very, very similar. And these are on sale for $10.80 down from around, I believe, $18. So if there's a shade that interests you in this formula, recommend picking up. They blend really beautifully. I think I did a video on these. Oh, I included them in my like pink blush video that I did. Um, so I will insert a link to that video if you wanna go back and see me applying that pink shade. Um, but they're a really great formula. And if the Rare Beauty ones are ones that you've been eyeing and you just haven't wanted to pay $20 for a liquid blush because you don't know how much you'll love a liquid blush formula, these are great and they're $10. Let's talk eyes. So I have quite a few recommendations from About Face. So About Face, their Fractal Glitter Eye Paints are 30% off. 
these are really fun they're really beautiful i don't have any of them in the new packaging i have like the original packaging that came in like a weird tin pouch but they've since repackaged them so it's in a more normal packaging really pretty lots of different shades i'll list my favorite shades down below because they're not all created equal so i will make sure i have that in the description as far as which shades i recommend the about face matte fluid eye paint these are so good these i have so many shades of these these are such a great flexible eyeshadow because you can dispense them on the lid and just blend them out or you can do more of a graphic liner look you can do a liquid liner they're a really cool formula they have so many different colors like more colors than you could imagine and they're 30 percent off so for around ten dollars i'd recommend picking one up just to see if you like the concept of a liquid eyeshadow because liquid eyeshadows aren't for everyone. The About Face shadow sticks are also fantastic. I'm wearing one today. I am wearing the shade Pearly. And this is, whew, I don't really think the name matches this. Um, because it's not like a pearl shade at all. It is a really beautiful, like, cool toned metal shade. And it's very flattering on the lids. They last all day. They're going to be 30% off. And they also are not all created equal. So I will have my favorite shades listed down below. Another eyeshadow I want to mention. It's new to me, but I picked this up during the sale. This is from ColourPop. Of course, Super Shock Shadows. I've been buying these for years. But I think this is a newer shade. It's called Sailor. And it's one of their ultra glitter formulas. I'm wearing it today over the top of Pearly from About Face. And it is a really, really pretty, like wet looking shadow. You could wear it on its own, or I like to wear it as a topper, but the Super Shock shadows are a great formula and ColourPop will be buy one, get one, 50% off during the sale. Let's talk lips. I have some more About Face. The About Face lip liners, holy moly, these are so amazing and they last forever. They are one of the longest lasting lip liners I've ever used. They glide on super smooth. They're super saturated. They last all day. They have tons of colors now and they're gonna be 30% off. Another about face lip product, the Cherry Pick Lip Color Butters. These are gorgeous. Uh, these are gorgeous. I've spoken about these before. These are 30% off. They are similar to the Tarte Mar maracuja ju juicy lip but they're a little bit different i would say they're almost like wetter looking on the lips and they smell absolutely incredible a couple of nyx lip products to touch on um the nyx fat oil slick click vegan lip balms this is their take on like the tart juicy lip these are fantastic i need to do a video covering all of the different versions of like the tart lip concept um these are great and these are buy two get one free so if you get this the next lip product i'm talking about and a bronzer you're in business um the nyx professional fat oil lip drip vegan lip oil these are great i love these caveat i would not say they're a lip oil i would say they are a lip gloss that is in a lip oil applicator so they're not as hydrating as a lip oil but they are a really, really beautiful, juicy, comfortable lip gloss. A couple new ColourPop items I wanna to touch on. Um, I picked up last weekend some of the new juicy plumping gloss balms with peptides, and then also their So Juicy Plumping Lip Liner with peptides. So ColourPop is buy one, get one 50% off. And this is what I'm talking about. I'm actually wearing this combo today. So for the lip liner, I'm wearing the shade Group Chat, and then I'm wearing the Plumping Gloss Balm in the shade Doe. Um, the lip liners were really interesting. They were like comfortable and like minty on application. They glided on really beautifully. I cannot speak to the longevity of these. So I wanna caveat this. I cannot speak to the longevity of these. Um, these, I mean, they're one of those like juicy plumping lip products they're not going to last very long these may be my favorite of like the plumping bomb concept that i've tried i've tried a lot of them something i love about this one is the formula itself 
is a bit thinner. So you're not going to get that build up and like what people refer to as like butthole <laughs> lips. I hate that term, but like on your lips where you kind of get some of the cobwebs when you're moving your mouth around. You don't get that at all with this formula. I'm hoping they launch more shades because I want to get even more. We are going to breeze through these last recommendations. Um, Ulta Collection, again, it's so hard to narrow down because there's so many fantastic products, but one of my favorite lip products from them is their Ulta Beauty Collection Juice Infused Lip Oil. This is going to be 50% off, and these are the best smelling lip oils on the market, in my opinion. They have a lot of different, actually, no, they don't have that many colors. I think they mainly only have four shades. Um, my favorite shade is the pinky one. I will have the shade name listed below. They're a very oily lip oil, and I mean that in the best way, and they're 50% off. The next is a product that like doesn't have great reviews on the app, I don't think, but I really like them. These are the Ulta Beauty plumped up pout lip balm so these are 50 percent off they're gonna be five dollars and fifty cents and these i think the reason why people weren't satisfied is i think they were kind of marketing themselves as they were going to be similar to like a tart juicy lip they're a stiffer lip balm however they have a tiny tiny like minty tingling sensation sensation that does a good job of just like gently plumping the lips, making them look a little bit healthier, just the right amount of tint, super easy to just apply without looking in the mirror to give you a little something something. I really like these. Last oil is from Milani, their fruit fetish lip oil. Love these lip oils. These are going to be 30% off. The colors are great. The formula is great. They smell good. Just a solid lip oil option. Now we're getting into a couple like hidden gems in the sale that are prestige products that are incredible that you probably don't know are on sale. The Urban Decay Naked Metal Mania Metallic Eyeshadow Palette is so good. It is so good. I picked it up last year because of Teresa is Dead. She influenced me. The silver alone is worth purchasing the entire palette. It is so, so good. And the palette is on sale for $29.50. It's over $20 off. It's so beautiful again if you look at it and you're like oh like i'm not gonna wear that purple i'm not gonna wear the black i'm like looking at the photo right now get it for the silver alone the silver alone is worth 30 dollars. it is the most incredible silver i have ever seen in any eyeshadow formula it is absolutely beautiful and then the other shades are so good too like the quality of the palette is fantastic it's like old Urban Decay OG good quality and not the garbage they've been coming out with these past couple of years. It's really good and it's $20 off. Last recommendation. Is it like super exciting because it's already so affordable, but I have to mention the Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. They have so many different versions now. I will put up on the screen the one I'm referring to and this is 30% off. So it's going to be $3.50. This is one of my favorite mascaras ever. I don't know why I sound like I'm crying. It's one of my favorite mascaras ever. It's under $5. I did want to shout out that they did come out with a brown shade. I'm going to be picking that up during this sale. I do not yet have the brown shade. It has good reviews. Everything I've read, it seems like it's the same formula as the OG Amazing one. And I love a brown mascara to kind of make my blue eyes pop. If you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much. I know this was rushed, hectic, a little all over the place, but... We did it, we filmed the video, and now I have to run to work. If you are not already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, and then let me know in the comments below, did you pick anything up during the sale? Um, or are you planning on it? And then is there anything that I miss that you are obsessed with or passionate about that is on sale during the sale that you think people need to know about? Leave in the comments down below.